think about generally the quality of all these players. There's so much parity here that it appears anyone could beat anyone. Yeah, well, definitely anyone could beat anyone on any day. It's just whoever wants it more, I guess, and whoever just fights more this week is going to be the one that wins in the end. Is the familiarity the reason for that parity? Probably, because we all know each other and we all know each other's games, and that makes it twice as hard, you know, because we know what shots they're going to hit, you know, every angle they're coming from. So I think definitely that's like one of the main factors. So, um, regardless of time, what are your plans going to do? Um, I just hope to have a great year. I had a good year this year, um, especially toward the summer. I had an amazing summer, so I just hope next year uh, my ranking will keep moving up and I just have a good year. Finally, uh, your aunt and uncle are here, mm -hmm. and they're here to celebrate. Any other family members here? Uh, I have a cousin. She might come tomorrow, but uh, they actually live in Norcross, so they're like really close, and my uncle was like so fired up <laughs> today, <laughs> and he like got me going in the third set, so I'm happy they came. Congratulations. I just have one quick question. I read in the bio you trained at the North Togo Academy. What yeah, was that I trained there. What was, it, what was that experience like? It was great. I mean, I trained there for three years. Um, Patrick, he's obviously an amazing coach. Like, look what he's doing with Serena. So he's obviously great. And um, I had a great time there, and I improved a lot. And I think it's a great academy. Thanks again. Thank you. You're welcome.